I'm Christopher Leiden, inside the open source factory. A handful of hard workers here making what feels like the future in public conversation. It's not NPR exactly, or public radio as we've known it. It's a much closer back and forth from this table to your earbuds in a two-way channel of attention across the board of people's passions, books, music, history, politics, ideas. I've been 20 years in radio now, public television before that. Before that, I covered politics from Washington for the New York Times. 50 years watching politics, and I've never seen a stranger year than this one. Trump is a walking id. Deep down, he wants to be Madonna. It's not idealism, per se, but these are people who are, at the end of the day, these people are, are screwed, and they know it. You have the killing of Michael Brown, but what does that do to the black population? What does it do to the white population? What does it mean for Americans? Think of us as an open incubator of ideas and conversations that you want to be part of. We work for ourselves and each other. This is where we do most of it, starting with the oatmeal ritual around my kitchen table in Boston. Mary McGrath and I have been working together for 20 plus years now. We disagree on a lot of things, but we're intensely interested in radio and journalism. From the beginning, the real magic between us has been drawing like-minded, literate, distinctive young minds into the game with us. The show at its best is like this open table we work around. That's the spirit I love to feel we've captured on the air. What we need to keep it ours and yours and original and independent is fairly modest but steady support from an expanding circle of people who are searchers too. We want to know what you're reading and thinking and feeling in a time of immense confusion. So here's the pitch simply, whatever you can afford, whatever feels right to you will help us diversify our staff It'll expand our production and raise our sights at a time of tremendous opportunity. We love this work, and we love the modern direction of it, with funding models like Patreon that are liberating journalists like me to play it straight with the audience. I hope you'll consider joining our community of open source enthusiasts and supporters, and please feedback on everything we're doing together. Thank you.